Hi there, my name's Vince from MyMateVince.com and in this video today I'm going to show you one of the benefits about having backwards compatibility on the Xbox One. And that benefit is that often you can still play damaged discs. So here we have an original Xbox game, The Prince of Persia, The Sands of Time, and unfortunately, although the disc is really clean, there is damage to that edge there. And now that damage is sufficient that this game will no longer work in the Xbox console. So really it's useless up until they release backwards compatibility and this is one of the games that does work with the Xbox One backwards compatibility with Xbox games. Now the reason it works is quite simple. When I put this game into the Xbox it's trying to read all the data off the disc so it has to be in good condition to get that data off it. But when I put this disc into the Xbox One all it needs to do is read the name of the disc. That's all it's doing. It's pulling the actual game off the internet onto your hard drive. So basically the game is stored on your hard drive, not on this disc. You just need to put the disc into your Xbox One to show that you do actually own the rights to play the game. So as long as your disc isn't snapped or so badly scratched that nothing can be read, even if you've got damage like this, it will still work perfectly on the Xbox One because all it needs to do is have enough information on there to grab the name of the game. So let me just show you it not working on here and then working on here. Right, I'm going to fast forward through this because it is going to take about three or four minutes to actually come up with the fact that the disc is damaged. Right, there we go. It says there is a problem with the disc you are using. It may be dirty or damaged. So as you can see, it's not working. Now I'm going to put that same disc into the Xbox One. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to change the input. Right, okay, so let's take the disc out. And now we're going to put the disc into the Xbox One. And now you can see that it is working when it comes to the Xbox One. So the reason for the video is to not throw away your Xbox discs even if they're damaged because the chances are if they do get released on the backwards compatibility on the Xbox One, you will still be able to play them, hopefully. Obviously if the discs are real badly damaged you won't be able to but hopefully you will. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and please subscribe for more how-to videos. Take care, bye now.